hi guys welcome to another vlog i know it has been so long since i filmed and there has been a couple of reasons for that so that's why i thought i would sit down with you today just have a quick chat a quick update before we continue with the vlog i was gonna go do a whole separate video on this but that's kind of boring so i thought i would just quickly update you now so i haven't posted or filmed in what feels like months it probably is it has been a long time and i'm sorry if i'm out of practice it has been a while since i picked up the camera but i have hated it so first reason why i haven't filmed my camera actually got stolen at my g7x mark ii got stolen out of my car which just signifies how crappy this year in particular has been um our dog passed away at the beginning of the year a house got broken into our cars got stolen my car got ridden off by the thieves um our fridge died our washing machine died now my camera got stolen it has just literally been a really crappy year this year and i so cannot wait for 2020 anyway so big reason is i just physically didn't have a camera i have a new camera now which is bigger and better and i hope you guys enjoy the new quality so that's super exciting i am still getting used to it it is a lot heavier as well and the viewfinder is in a different spot so i'm sorry if i'm not looking into the lens i'm still getting used to it second thing is is especially the last few months and before that of my channel i was finding myself censoring what i say really watching what i do what i say because unfortunately there are people in my like real life situation who watch my videos who don't like me which blows my mind because why would you even bother watching videos or following people on social media that you don't like just to kind of make judgment or start drama or twist things that i say or yeah it's just it's not fun so i was finding myself not being myself and censoring and tiptoeing around things just because i knew real life people were watching it and god forbid what they think or they might take things the wrong way and that's just really sad it's sad that i have to censor myself it's sad for them I don't understand it myself i don't watch videos of people i don't like and i certainly don't do it just to be snoopy and just to be you know judgmental about it so anyway i've kind of taken a few months to kind of look within myself and accept the fact that i don't care like i just don't care anymore so hi to all you haters or hi to people who are watching my video who don't like me um feel free i don't care um i'm i'm over it and the thing is i'm not going to apologize for being me i met me and if you don't like it then click off and if you don't like it and still want to watch well that's your problem not mine that was a second reason you will also notice that my channel has changed its name it is no longer cara collecting memories it's now cara louise so i'm kind of rebranding the channel kind of steering it more towards like a mature would you say mature am i mature that's a question to be um <laughs> Um, a more mature side of things I want to focus it less on the kids although you're gonna see heaps of them in vlogs and stuff but it's not going to be centered around them it, my channel is gonna be more centered around me so it's gonna be more about being a working mum and basically how I survive that my biggest question yes Ezra I'll get rid of it there we go my biggest question that I always get is how do you do it i've got three kids two under five and i work full time out of the home for 40 hours a week so it's crazy and i also have one at school one going into school um things are hectic and my biggest question is how do you do it so i basically want to share with you guys more on how we do things and how i cope and how i still keep being me anyway let's jump onto the video i hope you enjoy it i hope 
hope you knew the, like the new camera. I hope you like the new direction the channel's going in. Make sure you give it a big thumbs up because it helps my channel out. Um, hopefully comments will be back on. If they are, please say hi. I've missed you guys so much. And I'm glad you're all sticking around with us. And I promise there's going to be loads of exciting content to come. So see you soon. Today is a big day. We are off to Lucy's school. So she goes into prep next year. Hey Lucy, you going to big girl school? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. So we are off to Lucy's big girl school to do, what's this thing doing? Um, to do like a prep introduction a couple of hours at her school. So I've got Ezra in the back as well. I'm dropping him off at Grandma and Granddad's. And hopefully my camera doesn't fall off this. And we're heading to do that. So fingers crossed that, that is a success. Lucy has been crazy emotional this morning. Haven't you, Lucy? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we've had lots of tears already. So I'm just praying, I'm praying that it doesn't continue at school. Anyway, that is this morning's update. Luke is at home, very tired. He's been doing a night shift, so he should be sleeping, but he got up when Lucy was chucking a tantrum. So hopefully he's going back to bed and I have lots of cleaning to do. My house is a wreck. It is Thursday, my day off, so my usual vlogging day. So it's gonna be lots of cleaning in this video. I'm trying to get my shit organized. That's what I tend to do on my Thursdays as it's my only day off. It's usually when I am running errands, doing housework, getting the washing up today, kind of ready for the weekend so I'm not just spending all weekend doing crappy house stuff instead of doing fun stuff with the kids. Anyway, that is it. I'm going to turn the camera off because I really don't want it to fall and break. And I'm... And yeah, let's go do prep orientation day. Are we excited? Are we pumped? Yeah, let's do it. Hey. Cheese. Cheese. Mommy. Yes. I love you too. Look at those dogs. Okay, go wait. No, no, Ezra. Wait. There's puppies. That I don't know where it came doggies, from. Look. They're doggies. They're not our doggies. So, yeah, I don't really totally feel Mama. comfortable getting you out when there's strange dogs around. Okay, come on, buddy. Yeah, let's walk up to Grandma's. Hold my hand. Is he? Okay, Luce. So we just dropped Ezra off at Grandma and Grandad's and 
Me and Luke did like our first workout in forever last night and I swear to God guys, I just nearly fell down the stairs walking down the stairs because my legs gave out because they are so sore. So I guess, yeah, probably just shows how ridiculously unfit I am. How was it? Get set for prep, Lucy. Good. Good. Show us your picture you made. Where's your fish picture? <gasps> did you make that? Yep. Oh my god. That was so pretty. So you did good? Did you have fun? Mm -hmm. You liked the teachers? Mm -hmm. Are you excited? Mm -hmm. Yes! My big girl's going to prep. Okay, so we've come back from the get ready for prep program at no, Lucy's school. Get set for prep. Oh, sorry, stand corrected. Get set for prep program. Lucy did good. It started off a bit rough. She didn't oh what's this guy doing? People drive really crazy around schools. Okay. Um so it's a little bit rough to begin with that Lucy didn't want to go in the classroom and didn't want me to leave. So what happened is we rocked up and the kids went into the prep classroom all together and spent an hour there while the parents, which I didn't know, went and did some like language parenting workshop. Guys, it sounds as bad as what it was. Um, I, I, yeah. That is so not my thing, if anyone knows me. I suffer from really bad social anxiety. So, yeah. It was really hard, guys. Just making small talk with strangers, let alone parents. I don't know, I'm just not good with it. It totally stresses me out. I went into like panic mode, spilt tea all over the freaking floor. I'm just, like when I'm at work, not an issue, like I'm, I'm all over it, but you put me in any other kind of environment where I have to talk to people I don't know and make small talk and like, it was just awkward AF. It was so awkward and there was this like wanker Mommy. guy there that was like, my kid Please speaks me, 10 different languages Mommy. and yes. <coughs> Mom? Yes. Um, when, when we get home, what are we gonna do? I don't know, baby work that out when we get home so yeah it was just like super awkward we got put into these grooves and had to like Whoa. you'll like prep baby no, I don't. you get to do heaps of fun stuff no, we don't why don't you want to go to school but you got to be brave baby girl you get to do heaps of fun things like read books, okay. go to the library and play games. We don't even go to a library. You will. No, we won't. And your classroom's fun and your teachers are really nice. Huh? Yuck. It's yuck. You can't stay at daycare forever, baby girl. Yes. Don't you want to learn heaps of fun stuff and do heaps of fun things with Jackson? No. Don't you want to be able to read books? No. And learn how to write? No. You don't want to do any of those things? No. So you didn't have a good day today? No. You didn't have fun at prep? No. Well, what are we going to do next year? Are you just not going to go? Baby girl, come on. No. you got to be brave. No. Okay.
okay. Let's go do some fruit shopping. Shopping trips. Pardon? Yeah. Muscles are so so sore. Anyway, I'm gonna rest you on something because it hurts. Okay, is that gonna work? No, that is too short. Am I gonna rest you guys on? How about this? How about this. Ooh, makeshift tripod. Eat your heart out. Anyway, I just wanted to come on and end the vlog. I was supposed to do housework all day and get my shit together and I didn't instead I came home from Lucy's prep thing and watched Harlem with Luke because he's home because he's on night shift and then we went shopping which you would have seen in the clips and went grocery shopping I don't know if it's just our kids well Lucy's okay Ezra like he is so so hard to take out in public like so hard he just screams and cries he won't sit in the trolley he won't sit in a pram anymore he runs off it's just so stressful just going to get groceries anyway we also had to go get a present for a friend of ours whose little girl's birthday on the weekend so that's exciting happy birthday indy anyway we also i wanted to show you so i've got stuff just like stashed under here i also brought our christmas pajamas so that is lucy's little nighty they've got little santa mickeys on them so super cute and then that's my shirt which comes with a matching pair of shorts yes we are that tacky family well more like i'm that tacky mother who forces my kids and my fiance to all dress the same and look like dorks um that's i think that's yep jackson's pants Jackson's shirt and Ezra's got like the same one but mini version and Luke's got the same but big version. Anyway, I also got them the advent calendars. I always get the Ushi ones. My kids love them. They instead of doing like the 25 mini Ushis this year, they're doing the 12 like extra large ones, so 12 days of Christmas. I'm gonna do like a little Christmas sack 
to give to the kids when we do up the Christmas tree, like a December 1st thing. So I'm going to put their pajamas in it, the, Ush, the advent calendars, a book to read, most likely Christmas related, and a craft. So I thought that would be a good idea. Anyway, I might do a whole separate video on that if you're interested. So I got Jackson the Marvel one because he still loves this even though he's 10. I got Ezra the Toy Story and Lucy of course Frozen 2. Anyway, I'm going to call it a day. I'm going to go cook some pumpkin soup for dinner. I just wanted to come on and thank you guys for watching. I really hope you enjoy the vlog. I hope you enjoy the upcoming videos um, and the new content, the new banner, the new channel name. Let me know in the comments below if they are back on. Uh, if you like it, make sure you hit that subscribe button and I'm going to catch you guys soon.